I literally have no idea what I want to talk about. Um, but I really felt called to come on here. I felt called <laughs> for a long time to make a video to speak to you guys, to share what's been going on, my revelations and all that, but I don't know. A part of me it's like doesn't want to and it's not coming from a place where it's like oh i'm i i don't want to do this or oh, i gotta do this it's like maybe it's fear or maybe it's me just not realizing that me not realizing the power behind my words and forgetting the high value that i carry so I can inspire y'all, so I can help y'all through this journey called life. So, if you follow me on Instagram, you've seen me post every single day this whole entire week of the countdown of my magazine. I've been really, really focused on, you know, just completing it, getting everything together before my launch day, which is this Friday, 11-11. And if you're seeing this, you know, a year later or a month later, it's okay. There's gonna be a ne next issue, probably already sold out. Um, but anyways, yeah, guys, I've just been really, really, really focused and this message i want to share with y'all it's gonna be a really quick video i hope but this message i want to share with y'all is when you are striving towards something greater than yourself when you are striving towards your dreams and you're really working on it and spiritual war and warfare warfare <laughs> just adversity comes spiritual warfare I'm like having trouble pronouncing it but like adversity just hits the fan non-stop right when it comes to internal and external because adversity isn't always external it can be internal meaning experiencing emotions of doubt experiencing unworthiness experiencing fear and all these things coming to you to make you stop on your purpose to make you stop towards the goal to make you stop you see we cannot let these little small we cannot let these emotions that doesn't resonate with us that that isn't us take advantage to take control of our lives because <laughs> These last couple of weeks have been really, really hard and really stressful. And there was moments where I didn't feel excited about this magazine. There are moments where I'm like, do I even want to drop this? Can I even, am I even capable? But you have to remember your birthright, your birthright of living in this world, your birthright of existing. You see, we are all God's children and he wants the best for us. Whatever we can see, God can give it to us. Whatever we want to do, what our heart's desires, he will give it to us. We just have to believe and have faith. We have to believe, have faith, pray, and know that everything is working out in your favor. Even if it doesn't seem like it, even if day after day you are constantly going through trouble, coming through trouble, like every single day it's always something and you can't get a break know that things are working highly in your favor in times of desperate needs in times of struggle in times of deep sorrow and pain know that you are on your way to greatness you see they always say before things can get better, things have to get ugly. And that's just how it is. I wish it wasn't like that. I wish it wasn't that hard. But it is. It, you like you you learn from your struggle. You learn from your pain. You you build trust within the pain. You you build faith. You build faith in the hard times. Like that is the journey. The journey is not supposed to be easy. The journey isn't supposed to be all like sunshines and flowers and everybody hugging each other like I wish, but it's just not like that. Sometimes it can be and then sometimes your house is on fire. 
your mind is on fire you feel like you don't even want to go forward you feel like you don't even want to get out of bed like it's okay you just have to show yourself grace and understand where you're at and when there's moments of those times you have to automatically remind yourself why you're doing this of why you even got started within where, wherever you are within whatever you're doing why why did you get started like what's your intention behind all of this like what's the point because when you keep reminding yourself of that it builds courage it builds strength it builds resilience to keep you going if you're experiencing all these negative emotions and you're dwelling on them and not doing anything about it of course you're gonna give up of course you're gonna back down of course you're gonna be like this is not for me of course you're gonna agree with not being qualified but guess what guys the most successful people jesus everybody like the, like the most high valuable people felt unqualified they didn't feel right for the part they didn't feel like they were capable and able to lead millions of people to to freaking <laughs> speak on stages to be a superstar to be all these things what what do you think they had to go through it wasn't easy for them. They had to go through the dirt. They had to go through the mental pain. They had to go to, through their doubts, through their hard times, through their whole adversity to get to where they are now. And guess what? It doesn't stop. Adversity never stops. Pain never stops. The enemy will always come back. He will always come back and try to bring you down. But you have to remember your power. You have to remember your strength. You have to remember who you are. Remember your birthright and why you're here. You see, if you're here and you don't know and you can't see your value, you don't know what you have to offer to this world, bring this to god bring it to him and ask him to show you what he sees in you ask him to reveal your purpose ask him to help you and to guide you into finding it and you will sure you will sure find it you just have to believe and just just keep seeking and see keep looking because he will answer he will fulfill you he will fulfill your desires he will give you everything that you're looking for it just takes patience and patience is really hard it's really hard it's, it's a constant battle that i am fighting between my mind and it's just it's a struggle but as long as you're praying as long as you're keeping your faith and you're looking what's in front of you and not what's behind you will succeed you will get through it you will get through the obstacles you will you will win you are a winner so just remember that and that's all i wanted to say guys so i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i'll talk to you later